Welcome, welcome back on C-Score. In this video clip we're going to talk about function operation. And basically the same operation you did for real number, adding, subtracting, multiplying or dividing can be done for function. So let's take a look to number one, which says f plus g of x. That means you know, f of x plus g of x. Simply that. And here we're going to replace the functions. Yes, f of x is 3x plus 2. Right, if you want to put a parenthesis, you can put it just to show the function plus g of x, which is x squared minus 1. Again, let's put a parenthesis even though we don't need it. Okay, so here we're going to combine the like terms and we have x squared here plus 3x, and then we have positive 2 plus negative 1, which is plus 1. So this is f plus g. What about f minus g? Okay, f minus g of x similar. It's going to be f of x minus g of x. So in this case, we have uh, 3x, 3x plus 2 minus x squared minus 1. And here you really need parentheses, at least for the second part, for the minus g of x. And what we have here, we have negative x squared. And then we have plus 3x and positive 2 minus negative 1 positive 2. Okay. This is f minus g of x. Okay. What about f times g and f divided by g? Right. Let's take a look at those two. f times g of x is f of x times g of x. So basically here we have 3x plus 2 times x squared minus 1. Right. What do we get here? We can use the FOIL method or the generated rectangle. We're going to use the FOIL method. We're going to have here 3x cubed minus 3x plus 2x squared minus 2. So the final form will be, let's rearrange this polynomial in standard form, 3x cubed plus 2x squared minus 3x minus 2. This is f times g of x. Now, f divide, f divide by g of x is obviously f of x over g of x. So in this case, it's going to be simply uh, 3x plus 2 over x squared minus 1. Um, and here we're talking about the domain. Uh, so on this type of problem, you need to be careful to the domain of f of ng. Here, the domain of f and g are all real numbers. So all these, uh, we have all real number here, all real number here, all right? All real number here. Right, there is no issue. The only one you need to be careful is this one. Okay, because we have a quotient, the domain is all real number, but, except, but, x has to be different than plus and minus 1, because that plus and minus 1 makes the denominator 0. Let's, you try this one, let's see what you get.
if you have this answer for this operation of this f and g function f plus g right here f minus g right here f times g right here and f divided by g right here then you did a wonderful job the domain also all real numbers for all of them look at here and this one with the denominator is x squared plus one is never equals to zero so the domain of this uh, f divided by g is also all the uh, number. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click uh, uh, down right on uh, uh, this video clip on YouTube and come back and see Square for more math video clips. Thank you.